I just was? No. Where? With Margot. Oh, really? What did she want? Just to talk to me. About what? The problem she's been having. What problem, Kristen? Seems she's having a baby. Your baby, Clark. Wait a minute. Both of you. You courted me, made love to me, married me, and all this while you've been carrying on with Margot. Look, I had no idea she was pregnant. That's not enough, pal. Kristen, I love you. Ugh, I, don't you dare use those words with me. Is that what you told her? That you loved her too? Is that what you did to get her into bed, Clark? You gotta believe that it's all over now, and it has been for a long time. You've seen her, Clark. You've been seeing her many times since we've been married. Marco told me all about your visits. She's lying. No, you're lying. And now you're gonna pay for it. It's over, Clark. You're finished. With me, my family, and certainly Forrester. You'll never work a day in the fashion industry again. Now get out of here. I never want to see your face again. But first, I'm gonna rearrange it. Sweetheart, you look very thoughtful. I am. Why? What's going on? I guess now is as good a time as any. As good a time for what? To talk to you about something, Clark. Where were you just now? Talking to Margot. Which is what I want to discuss with you now. She called yesterday, left a message on the machine, wanting to see me. And she told me not to mention it to you. So I didn't. And when you questioned me about who I was going to see this morning, I lied to you. Or, well, at least I evaded the question, which is the same as a lie. Why did Margot want to see you? She wanted to tell me something. What? To tell you the truth. I don't know. She started to tell me, and then she stopped as she was getting into it. You mean you went to see her and... She didn't open up? You wouldn't believe how strange she's been behaving. I mean, why would I keep our meeting a secret? Certainly, Margo and I have nothing to hide from you. <sighs> anyway, what I wanted to say is that I'm sorry. I should have never lied to you, even though it was just a little white lie. 